Hello and welcome to my first video in absolutely ages. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing um, Clone Trooper Pilot uh, Matchstick um, from the. Oh, I can't remember now. Something Squadron. Shadow Squadron, that's it. I knew it was something to do with the grey on his head, uh, on his helmet. Ooh. Now, uh, this, I believe, is part of Clone Wars Wave 10 or 11. I'm not um, particularly sure. But um, I got this off eBay um, very early because it's September now and it's uh, not supposed to be out until December in the US and probably sometime in the spring in the here in the UK so I got it um, reasonably early um, it comes with um, DC-15 blaster now I don't know if he's gonna come with that in the actual um, wave uh, when he's actually released but uh, that's what it came with when I bought him he comes with a removable helmet as well and I believe that is Commander Pond's head which is basically just Rex's head modified uh, this is uh, a new sculpt removable helmet it's uh, well a Clone Wars pilot helmet obviously <laughs> Uh, well, it's the same as um, oddballs, really, just that it's removable and completely different colour scheme. But I love the colour scheme on this. It's it's almost like the tiger shark there on, on the decals. Oh, so yeah, I love that. Um, it goes onto his head. It slots onto his head. Um. Sometimes it doesn't go all the way down for some reason. I don't know why that is. It's just focus. Right there we go. Um, he has all the normal articulation: ball jointed head, um, shoulders, elbows, wrists, uh, knees, and ankles. And then he's got the swivel thighs. Oh yeah, and he has a ball jointed torso as well. Uh, so yeah, but I, I love this figure. Um, I might get another one. Mm. No, I might not. Well, I can't see me getting Commander Pons very cheaply now. Uh, could, well, not for a while anyway. I, I might just wait until Commander Pons comes. Uh, to the UK in Toys R Us if it does, um, hopefully, but um, until then, may be I should get another one of these and put the head onto uh, Rex and paint him up to be Pons. But uh, anyway, one sec, I've got a few more reviews. I've got. Um, Let's have a look. Uh, 41st, uh, 41st, 41st Elite Corps Clone Trooper. Just want to Commander Grease, obviously. Commander Grease himself. You will stand up. I know these aren't the weapons that they come with. Oh. Um, Grease doesn't come with those weapons, but I've just laid them like that. Uh, the Arth Trooper, which I've got on the speed bike at the minute, because it's the only trooper that I can display on it without ruining the stance, because it's got the new articulation. And uh, a recon trooper. So yeah, a uh, bit of a rubbish review, to be honest. Sorry. I haven't done a review in ages, so... Oh. Uh, don't really know what to say. I can't remember. Uh, I've also got uh, Mace Windu 
to review as well. Oh, I've got two. I've got the prototype that I got from eBay a few months ago, and then I've got the actual release with the clone gear, which I absolutely love. I was thinking about getting um, an, uh, another Mace Windu. Oh no! Oh no! I won't. I won't get another Mace Windu. But I use that clone gear, especially that helmet on. A clone trooper maybe and make it into mace windu in full clone armor uh, I think that'd be quite cool but uh, yeah bit of a brief review not very exciting sorry about that but uh, yeah keep your eyes open for some more reviews of this fella him 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 and him so yeah thanks for watching and bye bye